TV. Boxer Babu Yusuf released from prison after one year sentence over criminal gang allegations, Kampala, Uganda. Babu Yusuf, a 27 year old professional boxer, has been released from prison after serving a one year sentence over allegations of being the commander of a notorious criminal gang. The allegations were linked to several high profile robberies and attacks in Kampala and surrounding areas. Background of arrest According to the police statement at the time of his arrest, Yusuf and three other suspects, Satenda Emma, Mayengo Paul Musing Uzi, aka Mulafu, and Mawage Reagan, admitted to participating in multiple attacks and robberies. The incidents included UMEA Primary School in Kaibondo, Nansana. Badoko Primary School in Kayunga, Wakiso, Kayadondo Islamic Secondary School, Mataga. During the attack at Kayadondo Islamic Secondary School on February 9, 2023, the group killed a security guard, Mujumbi Solomon, and critically injured Asinjia John before robbing 111 million UGX, 111 million shillings. The group was also responsible for the robbery at St. Joseph's Junior Seminary, Nzwanjara, where they stole a communion cup, ciborium, and robbed 1,400,000 UGX, two laptops, and mobile phones from the priests. The police recovered three motor vehicles used in their criminal operations and other exhibits, including an HP printer, three laptop bags, black face masks, and various housebreaking implements. Yusuf's boxing career, before his imprisonment, Yusuf, also known as Rolling Tiger, had a promising boxing career with two professional fights, both of which he won, earning him the top ranking in Uganda, post-release statement. Upon his release, Yusuf issued a press statement expressing gratitude for his freedom and reflecting on his time in prison. Today, I got my freedom back as the court saw that I did not deserve to be in jail. I walk out a free man. I take full responsibility for what happened to me, not that I did any wrong but was majorly based on my young past. As young people, we should live responsibly as our actions can affect our future, our families, our lives, our friends, and relationships in the community. Yusuf acknowledged the impact his imprisonment had on his boxing career and his fans. My professional boxing journey was halted for more than a year, and this hurt many of my fans and myself. As for now, I will need a break to rehabilitate and then make a comeback soon, he thanked his promoter, Stephen Sambuya. His team, his manager Kabumbi Akleo, his family, and the Uganda Professional Boxing Commission, UPBC, President, Mayor Salim Uhuru, for their support, I thank Allah the Almighty for the second chance. I thank my promoter Stephen Sambuya and the entire team, Faisal, Sula, Dr. Roderick, and Joshua, for standing with me all through this bad patch. I thank my manager, Kevumbi Akleo, big up. I thank my wife and mother for not giving up on me. In a special way, I thank UPBC President Mayor Salim Uhuru for the kind heart. And everyone that had me in prayers, Yusuf concluded his statement with a promise to his fans, I will not take any revenge for those who pushed my arrest. To my fans, I'm sorry. I love you all. I will be back. Hasta la vista, promoter's reaction, Stephen Sambuya, Yusuf's promoter, expressed his happiness at Yusuf's release and optimism about resuming his boxing career. We are happy that Babu is back, and we're going to start from where he stopped. Yusuf's return to the boxing ring is highly anticipated, and his supporters are eager to see him reclaim his position as Uganda's top boxer. In the coming months, all the coming months are tough, and we are already champions. I just want to be a champion. So I'm already, and I'm just going in time so that I can also give them as well the ranking points from them. Feb so soon is conversation with other promoters outside the country, South Africa, Tanzania, to see that I can face their champions. So that's how it was. I'm really hard to see that I can get the medical support. Box D.